with um, any policy and we're mandated in the US to, to undertake a cost benefit analysis uh, for any policy that exceeds a cost of $100 million. That's, um, the, um, that is a regulation that was enforced or implemented by Reagan or President Reagan. So, so we are, um, we should be doing this. And if government agencies so far have not been doing it, then we hope that our analysis can be helpful in shaping policy. You know, one important part of this is that if people start, you know, seeing that their jobs are getting lost, there's the small businesses in their towns that they really value are going out of business. Um, and, you know, it, it's, it would be natural to start doubting, is it worth it? Should I really continue my self-isolation or is this too costly for my community? Uh, so I, an analysis of this kind is important to encourage people to keep going because if we don't um, do you know, the, the social distancing well enough, then it's all costs but no benefits, right? So, so we, we wanna make sure that if we do it, we wanna do it right. And then we need to suffer the consequences momentarily and hopefully then, you know, with, with um, appropriate economic stimulus and help to the most vulnerable people in the economy because they are the ones who are going to be the most, or, you know, the hardest hit by this. You know, we can, we can soften some of the consequences and share the burden of the economic downturn. So. Um, 